whipped cream. No, I like whipped cream. And, uh... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This is the way you serve it, just like that. This recipe was really too easy. We Is should, it too easy? This was too easy, yeah. It's not easy for me. We, <laughs> right. yeah, yeah. Ow! <laughs> uh huh. And now. You know, we're out of time. We're out of time. Yeah. Well, well we're just going to have to. Cut something out of the middle. <laughs> On this show, that's not going to be hard to do. <laughs> hey, all right, all right. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Easy. Oh, boy. Oh. This is getting better and better. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Welcome again to another edition of At Home on the Range, right here in the garage. Is everybody having a good oh. time? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's... Barbara, your relatives brought their friends this week, it and looks like. And it's growing, and it's what growing. You... Uh, well... You didn't. We start off every show, you know, oh, with boy. viewer mail and things that people send to us. And we've been getting some wonderful things, very unique. Remember we had that, that bottle top thing But last those week? things are not nice. Well, this is in response to our dog food show. You know, our dog food show... Okay. Um, has gotten the highest ratings of any of our shows. Do you, folks, do you folks know what these are for? Wait, wait a minute. You see, you see what I mean? So Go in ahead. response to our dog food show, because we know we have a lot of dog lovers that watch us because of the viewer mail we've gotten, uh, Royal Radke gave us these, and these are from Doggy Ventures Limited in Corona Del Mar. <laughs> and if you have a pet, this is a great idea. They're called doggy do bags. And oh, so boy. you put your hand in the doggy do bag, okay? And then you scoop up the doggy do, and you just go like this, and then you mm. just close the bag. Oh boy. Oh. oh boy. So for all those people that wrote for our dog then, food recipe, Barbara, you didn't, then what do you do with it? You throw it away. Where? I mean, what do you? Like, I don't okay. know. Recycle it. Where all are right. you? Okay. All right. Anyway, and then I have one letter that was, um, well, I'm always looking for interesting tips. I see that, yes. Okay. okay. This says, Dear at Home on the Range, I think your show is the greatest cooking show yet. I've watched many gourmet cooking shows for years, but I've learned more from your show than any other. Oh, boy. The other shows are too complicated or too <laughs> detailed. Your show is cooking more close to home. Enjoyed your Cornish game hen recipe. Your cooking is easy and makes sense to me. It's an enjoyable show. Please keep up the good work. Also, please send me the chicken pot pie recipe. Thanks, Betty Cicernos. That woman is sick. <laughs> now, if you keep on insulting all our viewers, no one is going to write we've to got, us. We've got to cook, Barbara. Um, okay, do I have time for one short one? One more, one more. I'll okay. put the... Uh... This is from Angela Levecki, and she says, please send us your chicken pot pie recipe. I enjoy your show and watch it every single week. So thank you, and, and I will uh, read more viewer mail on our next edition. So keep those letters and cards coming in and send us unique products. So All right. What are we making today? We're going to make, you know, it's Valentine's Day. Well, it's Valentine's Day to us, but we tape about three weeks out, so it's not Valentine's Day to the people that are watching, but... That's okay. Do Can they pretend it's Valentine's okay, Day? Okay, let's pretend. Because we've got, we've got a Valentine's show. Because Valentine's Day was when Barbara got married a year yeah, ago. That's right. And, yeah. uh, boy. And her, yeah. And her husband is, has been able to stand it for a whole year. That's <laughs> all right, huh? All right. So anyhow, what, we're, what we have in honor of Valentine's Day, we've got some heart-shaped pasta right here. Can the people see this? Let's put it under our Busby Perkley camera so they can see it. It's heart-shaped pasta. And, and while we're doing this, I'm going to turn a fire on under this wok. Wow, there it goes. Okay. Well, now this doesn't work. You what gave you me a bogus work? Valentine. I, you that said came with I, the pasta. You said that if I peel this off, I could stick it on I you. I lied. You can peel it and stick it. I lied. It. Yeah. It, um, <laughs> now, well. Uh, oh, I'm going to put it right here. All right, right where your heart is. Okay. Uh, 
Now put four tablespoons of that. That this is extra virgin olive oil. Extra virgin. Let's don't do the extra virgin joke again. Okay. Not it's getting old. It's you know real. we actually have regular viewers, so you have to freshen your jokes up now. All right. All right. The same old. Jokes Which reminds me, work. you keep referring to this as a comedy show. It's not a comedy show. This is serious stuff. It really is. I said that last week, but and it really is. You know what? Somebody came up with a really nice tagline: a cooking show for the deranged. Home on the range. <laughs> oh, boy. I thought, wow, that just says it all for me. Now, now getting back to cooking, we've, we've put four, we've put uh, four table, or was it three? How, how many I don't did you know. Put you talked to me now. I lost count. Well, that's enough. Okay. Uh, we put four, four? four tablespoons okay. full of olive oil in our wok. There's a lady in the front row who's actually paying attention. Boy, am I glad of that. <laughs> So there's four tablespoons of oil in the wok. Now, I have just cut up a half of a chicken breast. A half of one? Yes. Why don't you do a whole one? Well, because a half is all you needed. And besides that, this stuff is expensive. Really? All right. <laughs> yes. So we're going to put this in, in the wok now. And you're going to stir that and, and keep it going until it's brown. This half doesn't work. I'll fix it. Yeah, here. Now, now stir that until it starts getting brown. All right? Um, you know, maybe you have this flame a little too high. No, we want it hot. Stir it. Stir, Barbara. Oh, but boy. I'm burning my hands. Now, again, you know, we <laughs> never cook anything we don't use an onion. You know, it's... I know. You know what? We need a longer spoon. This recipe... Stir the pot, Barbara. This recipe calls for a uh, half an onion, so I'm going to... Barbara, stir the pot. I'm stirring it. Oh, you boy. you see that all the oil is coming out of it? You, sh you sure can't get good help nowadays. Uh, <laughs> boy, that's just doing great. Okay, so you're chopping up your one half, one your half onion. onion. It's supposed to be finely chopped. Now this, this is not a recipe. This is a thing that I just made up. So you don't have you made this before? I made it this afternoon. And it was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> How bad was it? Well, we uh, we uh, we didn't need it. We didn't need it. Mm -hmm. But I since then though I have I've modified the recipe and I think it's going to be all right. Now this is a half of a half of a medium-sized onion. Did you notice I'm color coordinated for Valentine's Day? Oh, you really are. Yeah, terrific. Well, I understand you sold another t another sweatshirt. Yes. In fact, we only have three left, and then oh, we're going to have to reorder them. They're going fast. That's terrific. Because every time she sells a sweatshirt, we can buy another roll of tape for the taping. <laughs> Ooh, one got away. All right. Now, um, now we have here. About five slices of jalapeno because this has got to got to wake up. It's got to be alive, and Whoa. jalapeno Whew. is uh, will do that. That's strong. In so we've got to chop know, this up fine, fine too. See. Talking about our um, our sweatshirts, if you saw, let's we see. were we were all through talking about the sweatshirts. Well, there was a picture of your wife in the L.A. Times Society section a couple of uh, weeks ago with uh, a lady from who's the head of CCAP, which is a charity organization. Yes, yes, and yes. And she had on a Home on the Range sweatshirt. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> Terrific. So, Terrific. We are getting, we're getting the message out there subliminally. Okay, how is that coming around? Oh, oh is, it, is the fire under the pasta thing? Is this kind of like Mexican? Is this no, this is very Italian. Yes, this is boiling, so we're going to take the lid off. Now, we're going to put the pasta in there. This is awful greasy. Now, we've got, greasy. we've got one pound of heart-shaped pasta. Now How this, come they're different colors? Well, that's just the way they came. And the, we've got this because it was free. It came from the Grey Goose in Westcliff Plaza, down on Irvine Avenue. They just gave you free they pasta? They just gave it to us, free, free. Why, because you were a TV star? Well, I, 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 I was in there shopping, and I said I wanted to buy some pasta for the show, and... They said, well, if you mention our name, you can have it free. So I, <laughs> I, I took them up on it. Stir that up a little bit. Wait. Now stir that up a little bit, okay? All right. So now, so, so are you just kind of roaming stores now and, and, and no, trying to bone no, every products? Week, every week I, I go shopping, and, and I just happen to be in there because it was by the bank, by uh -huh. Royals Bank. By the Royal. guy that makes that awful thing you had for picking up dog stuff. <laughs> This, hey, don't this, talk about Royal. This you know, store he's was a, by he's Royal's a, Bank. He is a fan, yes. and we don't have too many fans, so yes. we have to be nice to the three people no. that show up here. Now, back to cooking again. Now, these are, these are 
uh, mushrooms and sliced up this many mushrooms make one and three quarter inch cups of sliced mushrooms. With your mushroom slicer. Yes, and I'm From slicing. From the people that Isn't no longer great? advertise with us. Can the camera see this mushroom slicer? Isn't this great? Look at there. Boy. I'll tell you, this, the, the strangest things excite you. <laughs> well, hey, uh, at my age, kid, you know. It's a mushroom slicer or nothing, huh? Oh, that's yeah. looking great. You're doing a good job, Barbara. You are a great stirrer. I know. I have my technique is down pat, no. but our spoon, we're going to have to invest in a new spoon. It's There's starting to bend. Now, hey, hey now, now keep this stuff scraped off the side. It's burning on the side there, you know, like this. You know, get that stuff off there, okay? Everyone has their own technique, okay? Yeah, well, yours is not very good either. Okay. <laughs> Is that it's all, it? It's all in there. What about that broccoli? We're going to put it in that steamer over there. Is this, no. is this for that burner back there? Yeah. This is steaming. Okay. Whoa! You know what? I just had a piece of that chicken. Now, this is... This is uh, <clears throat> that chicken. When you buy broccoli, they, it, comes in, it comes in bunches. I think you better taste that. <clears throat> Barbara, the fire is too high. Um, Mercy. I think you got too much of something in there. No, I haven't. It's, it's a jalapeno. Whoa. The jalapeno is hot. It's very good. I'm having a rush. Yeah. Okay, that's if just... If I just faint, go on without a, me. That's... Uh, boy, that is that is coming along. Just Whoa. great. Whoa. I don't think... I think maybe you put too much jalapeno no, in there. No, no, it's just right. You know what we don't have in there? We should have... I'm going to turn this fire all the way What out. don't you have? It's supposed to have some salt. It's supposed to have one... one one teaspoon of salt. Oh my goodness! So that's uh, that's not a teaspoon full. That's not very much. I, no, I think stir I, that up. That's very little salt for is that. Is that very for little that, for salt? That much. Yes, that really well, is. Well, let yeah. me okay. let me tell you, if you are not into spicy food, this is not for you. God, no. my socks just rolled up. Oh, the, the fire is just, oh boy. Well, yeah, but it, no, no, it's got to it's got to have a little punch to it, or it isn't well, good. Well, it certainly does have some sip, but. <laughs> Now, oh, did, we didn't. with heart we, conditions, I wouldn't recommend this we didn't, recipe. Uh, did we start really the timer? Taste this. Barbara, pay attention to the food. Did did we start the timer on the? No, there's pasta? no timer in there. Oh, you don't know how long me. this has been in here. Uh oh, do you? we're gonna have bad pasta. What happened to our timer? Oh, here it is. Now that's been going what? Five minutes? Yeah. Yeah, fine. It's five minutes. So five more minutes is all it's gonna take. All right. Well, you know, the, you can just taste it and find out how well done it is. Well, yeah, but that's the hard way. No, that's a. Uh, you know, takes my grandmother used to do. Pasta. I know you don't like to hear about my grandmother. No. But well, your grandmother must have been a rotten cook. She was. She was terrible. But yeah. her food always smelled really good. Did it? And so what she used to do. Now, why are you playing with the I, with the I, pasta? I'm just feeling it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> um, what she used to oh, do boy. was she used to take the pasta and throw it up against the wall, and then if it stuck, it was ready. Boy, she must have had a messy wall. <laughs> She used to do that. Well, I can believe it, yeah. Boy. I guess today they'd say I come from a dysfunctional family. <laughs> At the time, we just thought we were colorful. <laughs> See, now, okay. I should have this one has the whole Now, that will never cook when you got it in midair. It just won't cook. <laughs> taking a peek at it and sure. taking a look oh. at it. Well, now, oh, speaking of Valentine's Day, what did you get your wife for Valentine's Day? Because you've been married forever. You've been married longer than I've been alive. A long, long time. In May, we will have been married 45 years. That's 45 right. years. Yes. Isn't yeah. that yeah. 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 I, I, I see. It seems like I've been married all my life. I cannot remember being single. single. Well, yes, I can, too. Yes, I can. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, I'm not even going to touch that line. No, no. Um, so okay. now there's no fire on this. No, no, we're that. waiting now. We're this waiting. is what you call waiting, yes. We're, what we're, are we waiting for? We're tap dancing, you know, we're just messing around there. We're waiting for the broccoli to get done. What about the macaroni? Well, the macaroni is all right. We're not worried about it. We're waiting. The broccoli is what we need, because the broccoli we're going to use next. Okay. Because we're going to put the broccoli in this, in this. Uh, How do you know when it's done? Now, what do you call a thing like this? This casserole is, dish. That's a casserole dish. A baking dish. Good. pan? You know, it says something on the bottom of it. What, what does it, it say? It says baking. Baking here, dish. You want to taste this and see so now, if it's done? Well, how's it going to get done when it's out here in midair again? It looks the Ooh, right it's color. Hot. It's hot. <laughs> Jesus. It's, it's done. It's just come out of the pot. 
No, it is done. It's done. All right. No, that is that is that is that is done. Oh. Damn. Now we're gonna we're gonna put we're gonna put two tablespoons full of butter in this in this is baking that butter dish. Butter margarine. That's margarine. We don't. Anyone that eats this we do, audience. We do not crazy. use margarine. I mean butter on this show. That's right. We just don't use it. So we're just now gonna, you're you're. We're just going to just around. smush it around, yes, with a paper Ew. towel. Isn't that awful? Yuck. That's gross. Isn't that as gross as that thing you brought in? Royals, boy. <laughs> well, that's kind of like All a right. public service. Now, do you suppose you can hand me the broccoli, just pick the thing right up out of there and just hand it over here? Certainly. Oh, look at this. Oh, what professionalism. That's terrific. All right. Now, we're going to put the broccoli in this. Now, the camera can't see this, can it? No, so but I can move this. move that over. Move that over, yeah. All right. So now we're going to put the broccoli right on top of that. Doesn't that look great, though? Whoa, oh, that wow. looks really good. Oh, wow. Look at that. And what about this? What about what? Now, just be patient. That uh, uh, We'll just set it down there somewhere. Not not in the bro not in the box. You know. Okay. Well, you know, it's a little heavy. Yes, it is. Should I stir this uh, pasta? No, you don't have to stir it. It'll, 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 it'll. It should just like Why don't stick you stir to the, the pasta? sides and the bottom stir, and that. Stir the pasta. And we'll just scrape it off later. Ooh, you know what? These are done. Are they done? They're are looking they, kind of mushy. Are they really done? Are they really done? <laughs> now, what we have here, we have a, a quarter of a pound of, of cheddar cheese that we're putting right on top of this broccoli. We've got a quarter pound of mozzarella cheese here. See, I told you this is very Italian. Aha. Uh -huh. And that goes right you there. You know, they do make low-fat um, mozzarella cheese. Do they? Yes. Let's pretend that thing well, is already... Well, they got mushy, so they don't kind of look like carts <coughs> anymore. Let's pretend that that thing is they already... They look like wagon wheels gone awry. <laughs> no, they're, they're hearts. It's Valentine's Day. You're losing the spirit of the day. Oh, it's no, Valentine's I'm in the day. spirit. I'm in the spirit. Look at that. Is that good timing? Did you hear you that? Are, yes, you are getting you so good at ring? this. All right. Now, oh, now, bring that back and put it right there, please. All right, good girl. Ooh, there's something that went... Oh, well. That's what you... You rinsed your spoon off in there when you had it in the stuff. You know, this is... Well, we know it's edible. You know, have, have you noticed that this is a very quick thing to prepare? It's practically all done already. Really? Yes, yes. yes. Now, this is one of those quick, now, easy dishes. Yes, now, now this is about, about two tablespoons full of olive oil in there. Okay? Maybe They're a little, not believing you. Maybe a little less. Maybe a little less. Now we swoosh that around, get olive oil all over that. Isn't that good-looking pasta, though? Why don't you put it over here so that All right. we can Look see that. from that now. camera above? Now, now, now this. Okay, so we you're put this swishing. In here. We put this in here. That's got an awful lot of oil in it. You it does have. It. It's got six tablespoons full. The whole dish has six tablespoons full of, of olive oil and one tablespoon of margarine. But that's all vegetable oil. And there's a lot of food here when this all gets together. Can I swish? So, yeah, yeah, now carefully. Don't, don't smash the pasta all up, you know, so it still looks like hearts. But it does have to be stirred up, yeah. Okay. Have, have you noticed how, 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 how neat I am? Yes, and I also think it's disgusting that you have that dirty rag with that greasy thing. You don't use any This stuff. rag is not dirty. <laughs> we, uh, we washed this rag, uh, oh, two, three weeks ago anyhow, <laughs> at least. Now, we put the... Uh, I'm, you know, we can, well, we better do it this way because we don't want to have a big, uh, big mess, huh? I have another spoon if you'd like me to assist you. Oh, wouldn't that be fun? We can do this together then, yes. You know, you never told me what this is called. I, well, I don't know what. What do you call it? What do you think it is? I don't know what to call it. This just happened. Well, I'm tired of sending recipes out calling John Surprise. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are getting creative with these names. All I can tell you, though, this, this has got to be very good. Nobody's ever okay, eaten it, but it's got to be good. Okay, a heart macaroni surprise. Hmm. Yes, yes. Now, that's, really now that's cheddar cheese again. Cheddar cheese again. And this is, this is mozzarella. Now, did you grate this yourself? And we've got to put this in the oven for like about six minutes is all. Because all we're going to do is melt the cheese. That's okay? it. Because everything is basically cooked. Yes, and that oven is at 450 degrees. So 450 Which is very for hot. six minutes. Six minutes. So what are we going to do for six minutes? Well, we could tell people that they could write for this recipe if they'd like to attempt this at home. Uh, I don't think anybody wants to attempt it. Well, I mean, no, no, seriously, no. This is a, this has got to be a good dish. 
It, it and was. if it's not, you can just put it down your garbage disposal. Uh, <laughs> Or maybe you no. can doctor it up and send us no. a new recipe. And at least if it's not good, it's very healthy, you know. Healthy, yes. A lot of cheese, a lot of salt. But not, there's, a, there's probably a quarter of a teaspoon of salt in there. Yes. Yes, that's right. Now, I know my eyesight's not going. No, you saw me shake it in. That, that, that I shaker. I saw you do that. They yeah, well, that, just, a, that. just a few greens. Oh, I forgot to put the, I forgot the garlic. Oh. <laughs> It was supposed to have a tablespoonful of garlic. This is garlic, garlic, crushed garlic. Well, at least you don't have that other garlic that came in and a it was, And it was too. supposed to have some of this. So you know, now. Now, you know, we've been talking a long time. I bet our cheese is almost melted. Oh, it is. It's melted. You talked for 10 minutes. Do you know that? I did not talk yes, for 10 minutes. Yes, you did. Minutes. No, we've got to take this out of here because it's so done. So anyway, listen to uh, Kick FM and hear our ads. And, you know, we're going to start to give some stuff away. Oh, boy. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, oh. How can this oven is downhill? You know what? Well, we're in the garage. I mean, I don't think it's... Oh, look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh. Here, put it here so we can see it. All right. Isn't that beautiful? Now, it would have been better with the garlic and the, uh, the red hot pepper. But isn't that a nice dish? Aesthetically, it looks good. And it will, and it tastes good. Because you've got the butter under the broccoli. Because broccoli is, is really not very good stuff unless you do something with it. And you've got the cheese on top. <laughs> and In fact, I wouldn't even have it except that... The bush is out now, so we can use broccoli again. <laughs> so, that's all right. Okay. All right. Did somebody try to throw a little bit of that political humor in? Is, is that? That's not. That's not funny. Oh boy, we lost big. Oh, that was not funny. <laughs> I know you still haven't recovered from it. <laughs> oh boy. Well, I think that the, is the show over now. Are we all? This done? is it. Well, why don't we say goodbye and see him next week, and uh, and uh, we'll try to come up with something better next week. Okay. You got it. Bye bye. All right. Yeah, yeah.